Seeing it again, cool and dry over Southern California, while the northern half of the state gets ready for yet another storm, a pattern that's been set up all winter long. Below average rain here, above average rain and snow there. So I decided to go to the National Weather Service to find out the reason why. Precipitation snowpack is, is our gold. So we need that to carry us through the dry season every single year. Alex Tardy is a meteorologist for the National Weather Service here in San Diego. We started off record dry in San Diego, not just in October, November, but all the way into early February. We had never seen a time in San Diego that was so dry at that point of the winter. But it was a different story for the northern half of the state. Northern California, not only were they wet, they were much above normal. Tardy uses a baseball analogy to explain. We were outside of the strike zone of the storm track repeatedly. And so you had a very wet, even a wet start to Northern California, but a wet ending to Northern California. At the same time, we were much drier than normal. California was split in half. This is why the storm track was going not just to our north in Northern California and Oregon, but down to our east. So that puts us on the dry side and the windy side of all the weather systems. By mid-February, the pattern shifted. Three or four inches of rain in San Diego, some precipitation. Our, our whole water year so far has come down to March. The good news is the Sierra Nevada has plenty of snow. This is now three years in a row of normal or average or above, and we can manage and we can refill all the reservoirs. And what about the summer ahead? The short-term projections as we go into the summer are for much above average temperatures and, and pretty high confidence. And as you heard Alex say, it looks like the summer is setting up to be above average temperatures with more heat waves. Sean Stiles, CBS 8.